Hello, everyone. <coughs> You've caught me at a time where I'm sitting on the couch watching Puppy Dog Pals. Why, you ask? Because I'm waiting on a delivery. A delivery of my first two first light warming layers. I feel like I'm waiting on Christmas. They can't get here fast enough. What I have in route is the kiln quarter zip and my Calamit hoodie. And I can't wait. I have been trying to save money to get these warming layers for a long time. Mostly because I'm jealous of people that I see on TV. But I also want to review them and see how good and how much the hype really is worth it. So, probably the next thing you're going to see is me, Giddy's a little schoolgirl, doing my review of my first light gear. All right, just got the text message, got my monster in the back seat, and going to pick up my first light tops. I am so excited. So, I will see you guys in just a second. Yeah. All right, so I tried to wait as long as I could to get some stuff done at the house, but it is killing me. So, here it is, the first light box. Let's go ahead and open it up and see what they sent. Let's dig in. All right, there is the kiln and the calum. The box out of the way. Okay, so the kiln feels actually heavier than I thought it was gonna feel thus far. And then the Kalamath also feels pretty heavy, which is fine by me. So let's try the kiln out first because it's gonna be my closer to skin layer. Ooh, ooh, that feels... <laughs> Watched a lot of videos and a lot of people say that it's really soft and it feels real good and they're not lying. <laughs> that's some really, that's some soft material and it feels real good, it looks like it's really tight woven merino and everything seems to be like pretty high quality on that and we'll take the calamus out real good real quick again real soft material feels really comfortable this is that pattern that i was talking about this is the specter pattern it's got some some green and red which is close to their, uh, not the cipher pattern, but the other, I can't think of what the other pattern is called off the top of my head. Um, but the background is not white. This, the large lines, they're not white, they're more of a khaki color. Um, I think it's gonna look real good here in Kansas. So pretty excited. I'm gonna try them on real quick. All right, so <clears throat> this is the kiln quarter. I just kind of put it on next to skin. I'm 5'11", 194 pounds. It is, I mean, it's tight fitting, but this is supposed to be next to skin or second layer. It's a little long in the sleeves, but it's fine because of the thumb holes. Because once I put the thumb holes on, I got plenty. I still have enough material to to just kind of move around and it covers your hand pretty well which is i've had other hold on a second baby get that off your face get that off your face i've had other thumb hole gear um i like this one uh, because it covers my hand pretty good so then i slide my glove on over that so this is the kiln quarter it doesn't come down very low it's really comfy really soft comes down right about where it's supposed to be, I would think, um, or the way that I like it. So that's the kiln quarter. Um, and then I'm gonna put the calamathon over top of this because that's how, that's the order in which I bought it. So that I could wear this underneath that as it gets colder. And it's already getting kind of warm. All right, here is the calamath quarter zip. And I can tell you I've had this on for 15 seconds, I'm already getting warm inside of my house. It's 
thick, but it's not too thick. It's got a little bit of, it's, I mean, it's got some extra material in the sleeves here, but I mean, I don't think it's too much by any means. Um, you can definitely tell that it was cut to go over top of another layer. Um, still about the same length down here, which is good for me. Again, I don't mean to be the guy in every other video that I've seen about Perflex stuff, but it does have, you know, the, the chest pocket and stuff. The zippers are, I mean, it sounds like a zipper to me. It's not ultra quiet, but it's not ultra loud. The material is really soft, and this thing's gonna be warm. This is gonna be real warm. And then there's my hoodie. So I like it a lot. It looks good. I think this pattern is gonna be fantastic for Kansas, honestly. So super soft and super comfy. I am so excited and I'm glad I spent the money. This stuff is gonna be really, really warm underneath my other stuff i can tell you that so there we have it i am super excited about my first first light pieces for up top um and i think here in a minute i'm going to go over all of my first light stuff that i have which is four pieces um and then what i used last year um which would be fairly interesting but i'm telling you i've worn this for let's see two minutes now in the in this video and maybe 15 seconds longer i am getting warm underneath this stuff right now so this stuff is awesome and yes it works for as thin as it is i am getting really warm inside my air-conditioned house in may in kansas so all right see you in just a second so it's the next day the weather changed quite a bit and I went ahead and threw these on to walk outside because it's like a 30 or 40 degree difference outside and see what it was like in the wind. And we have wind constantly in Kansas. Um, I have other warmer winds. See, I'm getting blown on right now. And the thing is that it actually is cutting quite a bit of the wind. Yeah, I've got a pretty good breeze on me right now. I have other warming layers that are waffle tops and, and, not, and synthetic and stuff like that. Um, that I got really cold with last year. That's why I bought this stuff. And I'm actually really surprised because this is just this Calamuth and Kiln are, are enough to cut out quite a bit of the edge off the wind. Um, so again, super happy with the purchase. If you want to get into the technical hunting gear game or technical warming layers for hiking or being in the mountains or whatever, I would highly, highly recommend First Light. They have a ton of different um, patterns and colors, solid colors and everything like that. And they have great gear. Hey guys, thanks for watching this review. I am going to make, I'm not going to review all of my stuff, um, uh, on this video It'll just be too long. So I'm going to save that for the next video. And also this next week I've got my boots come in. So I get to review my boots. So if you like the content, like, and subscribe, thanks for kicking it with me and you guys have a great day.